welcome back to Card Kings for Kids. Um, today we're going to be kind of explaining how to do, um, how to do and what is like a sports card break. We entered one and uh, we got some cards, so we'll be showing those as well. And just as a reminder, our 25 subscriber giveaway, we're at 24. So if we get one more subscriber, then we will um, give these cards away. Make sure you check out that video. Here's a reminder of the cards we'll be giving away. Um, this one as well. So let's get into the um, explaining the break. So this break that we ended up entering, we got a lot of people here participating in Card Kings for Kids. There's four kids, one dad, and so we represent a lot of teams or have a lot of teams. One of them is the Detroit Pistons, and so there was a break where a, a hobby box was being opened, and the Detroit Pistons was a team that had not been purchased yet. It was a pretty low price. Uh, we ended up bidding on it, not really fully expecting to get it, but we did get the Detroit Pistons lot. And so what they did was they opened, so for the, I guess we bid on it on eBay, it was about $5 with another $5 shipping. So for about 10 cards, they were going to open a, or sorry, for about $10, they were going to open an entire mosaic hobby box and we would get all the cards related to the Detroit Pistons. So it can be a fun way, especially if you have a favorite team, where you can get the cards specific to the team that you like. And it can be cheaper because some people want, you know, in this year's people want the Pelicans so they can get the Zion. And, and that particular team was selling for, you know, a couple hundred dollars or, or whatever. I don't know the exact price. But no one really seemed to want the Pistons, even though they have a pretty good rookie. And so we got it for ten dollars. And so we watched this. We saw what we got, but they came in the mail. So we're going to show you guys the cards that we got from Mosaic for a total of ten dollars. And you don't, you're not guaranteed any cards necessarily. Maybe no one. As we watched, what teams seemed to be coming up a lot? It seemed like the Warriors came up a lot. It seemed right. Yeah. Um, there was one autograph in the box. It ended up being a San Antonio Spur. It ended up being a George Gervin, a Hall of Famer, retired. Uh, and so that one went to the San Antonio Spurs team, whoever bought that. Um, but, yeah, it looked like the the Warriors came up a lot. And then it seemed like there were some teams that maybe didn't come up very often. Yeah. Know? So you run the risk of getting, you know, maybe ten cards, maybe two cards or whatever. So you get that, that risk. But, um, again, some mosaics for... For ten dollars wasn't too bad. So this was, what's this? this? Is a Blake Griffin? In it to win it. In it to win it. Kind of got a nice mosaic to it. That's it, a. It's a really cool looking card. It is. So the mosaic hobby box itself, man, that would be way outside of our price range. So we wouldn't be able to buy that. But you can get some of the hobby exclusive inserts. Possibly you get a chance at that. Um, Here's a Derrick Rose Stairmasters, another insert. I don't know if that's available on, on some of the retail stuff. But yeah, that's a hobby only. Okay. And here's, these must be just some of the base ones because they're all packaged together. So. Bruce Brown. I guess I'm just flipping on. Derrick Rose. And Luke Kennard. So for $10, we got five cards. That's roughly $2 a card. That's kind of, it seems like what the mosaic cards are going. I mean, we wouldn't, we didn't make any money. We wouldn't be able to sell any of these individually on eBay for, for anything near what we paid. But that's probably about what we would have paid for, you know, almost on a per card basis at a hobby store. So um, nothing super impressive, but we didn't feel like we got ripped off either. So mm -hmm. anyway, that's kind of how a break works. And, and these are the results of the break that... We entered. They in, in this case they they open one hobby box. Sometimes they open multiple boxes, or they open a case, and and depending on what they're opening will help determine the cost of it. But for for not too much, we were able to get five pretty decent mosaic cards for a team that that we like. So those mm -hmm. are the principles behind behind a break. Yeah. So thank you guys for watching. Make sure um, you go check out some of our other videos. Um, 
go comment on the video where we announce our giveaway so you can hopefully win some of those cards. Well, all of these magic cards. Um, thank you guys for watching. Make sure you like, subscribe, and we'll see you guys next time. Peace.